Hello guys and welcome to a new lesson in Linux. In this lesson we will learn how to install the Linux CentOS. First you will go to CentOS.org scroll down to CentOS 6 release and click here on this link it will display here all of the mirrors that I'll choose this one here Install the Linux minimal version, choose this one, CentOS minimal.iso. In normal case, it will start downloading and you will wait for it to finish, but I have it already, so I will not wait for it to download. Now, let's see how to install it by using the virtual box. Open the virtual box, click on new. Here, you will type the name of the virtual machine that you will create I'll type crash and then from type you choose Linux and from version you will choose Red Hat 64 bit and next from here you choose the memory size make it 1024 you can make it from the scale or you can type it by numbers and press next the hard drive you will leave it on this option and press on create the hard drive file type you will leave it on VDI and next the storage on physical hard drive you will leave it on dynamically allocated and next the file location and size I will change the size here to 15 gigabytes and press on create now you will click on the virtual machine crash and then click on start you will click on the icon on the right and click on the CentOS ISO and open press start and now you will press enter on the first option which is install or upgrade an existing an existing system it will start running the installation process now Now if you want to test the CD or DVD you will click yes but here I will skip it's found local installation media and it's running the anaconda from here now I will change the view first and switch it to scaled mode and press here switch I'll make it a little bit larger so that you can see now I'll press on next I'll choose the language and then next and from here you choose your keyboard I'll leave it at English press next and what type of device your installation involves you will leave it at basic storage device and next click here on yes discard any data and then from here you will type your host name and then next and here you will choose your time zone you may choose it from the screen as you can see here or you can choose it from the list below I will choose Africa Cairo and next here I will enter the root password two times and next and from here you will choose create custom layout and then next here it shows you that you have one hard disk 
and it shows you the letters SDA if you have another hard disk it will be SDB and if you have a third hard disk it will be SDC and so on under SDA here it displays the total size which we have given which is 15 gigabytes I will highlight here and then press on create I will leave it on standard partition and press create click here next to mount uh, point I will choose the home partition and I will give it 5000 megabytes as size this means that I will give the directory home 5 gigabytes as size now I'll press OK as you see here is the number 1 after SDA and this number refers to the partition that this is partition number 1 and here it has created a partition which has the size of 5 gigabytes so I will highlight down here to create another partition press create and I will leave it on standard partition and create next to mount point I will choose the boot partition and I will leave the size at 200 megabytes and OK now I will press create again I will highlight a new partition and press create I will leave it at standard partition now I will create a partition for the swap and I will create it from the file system type you press here from file system type and choose swap it's preferred that you give the swap twice the size of the RAM so the RAM was 1024 so I will make the swap 2048 and press OK now I will make the partition for the root I will highlight a new partition press on create and create again and from mount point I will choose the slash which is the root then from here I will choose fill to maximum allowable size and this means that all of the other directories except the home and the boot will be under the root partition now I'll press on OK and then now I will press on next and from here I will format press on format and then press on write changes to disk it will start creating file system now from here I'll press next it will starting it will be starting the installation and here is the list of packages completed this process may take some time so I will pause the video and then be back ok now it has completed the installation I will press on reboot and here I will press enter I press enter one more time it's getting ready you see here is the version on the bottom right CentOS 6.5 now you will type root press enter and type your password 
press enter and you have successfully logged in by root crash and by that we have learned how to install the Linux CentOS thank you for watching and see you in the next session